What's going on? Average Tech Guy here, and today we are back. More tech, more reviews, and it's finally here. Samsung season is upon us. We got new phones, we got new tablets, and we definitely got new cases. So today, I'm gonna be showing you guys some cases from the company Subcase. Let's check them out. All right, so here we go. This is what we got. Uh, we will get to the cases in just a little bit, but first off, let's talk about the models of these phones. So up front, we got the S22 model. This is gonna be the smallest of the bunch. Then we got the S22 Plus, a little bit bigger, and then the big boy in the bunch, the S22 Ultra. This is the one that I will be picking up probably in that green or that burgundy. So stay tuned for all those videos. We got tons of case videos coming. This is just the first one, subcase, eye blazing, or normally some of the first ones that I do this one is subcase by choice all right so first and foremost we are going to put these two to the side for now just because the cases that we're going to be working with are specifically for the s22 ultra now Ultra being the brand new model that will have S Pen technology built right into it. We're going back to that S Pen. We're going back to that Note series. We like it. We love it. Can't say much more about it. I've just been waiting on this phone to come back out. All right, with that being said, we do have a few cases. I'm going to grab them because I just couldn't wait to go ahead and open them and check them, check them out. So we got some Unicorn Beetle cases, and we got the newest of the bunch, the Unicorn Beetle Edge. All these are from Subcase. Now, these are new in the sense of Subcase has never done a clear model of this case before, and this is the camo version. So you still get the same great protection of these cases, Unicorn Beetle style cases, and you get the holsters, which we know that the holsters have that 360 degree turn that we all love and know. So when you got one of these on your hip, automatically dad mode activated. You got the holster on the hip. This one turns a little bit easier, a little bit more freely, but it's clear to match the clear casing. And the other ones are gonna still stay black. So if you were thinking about getting a purple one, a red one, a blue one, a green one, your holster is still gonna be black. So we got that out of the way. Holster, I'm gonna put these back behind somewhere. All right, so now this is what we got. Um, let's start with Unicorn Beetle. We know we got protection all the way around the edges, super protective for your devices, and you got that sturdy kickstand. You got tactile buttons on it. Say no more, say no less. Let's go ahead and get it open. So every Unicorn Beetle case is gonna open right there at that corner. Once you get that corner open, everything else is just gonna pop right out. Normally, you can just drop that front on and you're gonna drop this case in bottom first, then come up and around, and that's what you get. You are now good to go. So first thing we like to notice is that camera protection because camera protection is one of the best things about these cases. Camera sits down in that deep groove. You don't have to worry about any of your lenses getting scratched up, and this year there's no big bulky back on there so you don't have to worry about that big bulk everything is flush to the actual phone itself then you got your different standing angles that one landscape and portrait you can do both click it back down in there you're good to go one thing i do actually love is you can see those edges right there so when i drop that phone it's all case all the time never going to damage the screen on your device no matter what unless you drop it on a jagged edge but if it lands on a flat surface you're good to go nice and protected all right so we talked about the raised edge we talked about the camera protection we talked about the tpu like hard rubberized tpu now you got the cutouts so classic cutouts right here for your s pen bringing that back and you actually still got the flap down here right in the bottom that flap is gonna protect against dust and dirt and grime and all that good stuff. All of our cutouts match up. Everything looks really good on this case itself. Now, when you wanna take it out, once again, down here in this right-hand corner, just pop it loose and boom. 
take it out of the case and you're good to go. Now this clear is not a real clear. It's gonna just basically be kind of like a transparent frosted clear. So you're still not gonna be able to tell really that color behind other than looking at your camera area or what have you, but you, you still will be able to see some of the more noticeable colors such as that burgundy, uh, that green. And I think that green is gonna be a really nice one. That's probably the one I end up getting. All right, so once again, camo. And we will revisit all these cases when I actually get my phone and we'll be talking about the charging, the battery and all that good stuff. But still got that same kickstand, love the kickstand. Still got that same camera protection, love it. Screen check because we got all this lip up front up top and down bottom. You're not gonna have any issues with your screen being damaged if you drop it on a flat surface. Nice, we like it. Buttons on here, nice and tactile. There are no issues with these buttons. And I said it once, I said it a million times. I've been using these cases for the past four or five years on my devices. Probably some of the most protective cases out there. I just wish somebody, I wish somebody would listen and get me an orange one. That's all I want is an orange one. But I digress from that point. Let's talk about the edge. This one is in black. Now, the edge actually comes in two separate pieces. We'll talk about it in just a moment. But it actually has a built-in piece for the fingerprint sensor, the underscreen fingerprint sensor. Here we go. Edge, two separate pieces. Um, now, this is black around the edges, yes. But the sides are actually gray. And if you can notice the 22 plus is more rounded and the 22 ultra is squared off pointed. So we do have that feature traveling over into these cases. These cases are more pointed, more edgy, more jagged. Once again, this is going to snap on front. So it's still going to give you that nice protection and it's a built-in screen protector on here. Now I will tell you that you can just give a little bit of heat to that screen protector and take it out because I'm sure Samsung is going to give you a screen protector on there. But if you remove this piece of plastic, you have voided your warranty with subcase. So just keep that in mind. This is what you get. You do get awesome protection for those lenses. Camera sits down in that deep groove. You don't have to worry about it too much. Down bottom, you do get a spot for your S Pen. So S Pen confirmed, we know it's coming back. It's in full force. We're good to go with that S Pen. You got a spot right there. All the other cutouts match up and you still get that nice raised lip. So when you drop it on a flat surface, it's all case all the time, never your screen. We like it, we love it. Buttons, not so tactile on this one. They are more flush, but you can still feel them go in. Not as tactile as the Pro over here. Um, but when you wanna take it out, still that same corner, then you pop it out and voila, there you go. Now this one is going to be a fingerprint magnet. That clear backing, you are going to have fingerprints everywhere. So just keep that in mind. If you like fingerprints, go for the edge. But nah, you it's, it's a nice case, but like I'm 100%, like you're gonna get fingerprints. So I keep a cloth somewhere close by because I got real sweaty hands and I'm gonna have fingerprints everywhere. But that's pretty much it. Um, so, so this box holds more cases for the plus and the regular S22. I figured we would just talk about the ultra right now because like all these same color cases, the camo, the clear and the actual edge are in this box for the other phone. So I figured I wouldn't really show you those cause you've already seen them. Um, other than wanting to see like if they have rounded edges, which I'll just take one out just to show you that as you can see and that paper is just sticking to me all right <laughs> this is the edge for the s22 i want to say this is for the plus let's see yep this is for the plus so we got the plus right here we got the ultra right here and you can see that those edges are rounded and these are more pointed and that's the only difference in these cases so one is rounded one is pointed but all these are exactly the same as what I got in the box right here. 
So I'm gonna put this back in the box, slide the box back, and that's pretty much it. So when we get more of these in, which I'm sure we'll be getting more of these cases in very soon, um, I'll be doing a full review on the full line of cases so you guys can see and pick which ones that you like. These cases normally run anywhere from about 12 bucks all the way up to about uh, 18 to 22 bucks. So just keep in mind, you're not going to really break the bank or hurt your pocket too much with these cases. And you're going to get top notch protection when you pick up one of these cases from Subcase, whether it be the Edge or whether it be one of the UB Pros or whether it's the UB Style, which hopefully I'll get some of those in very shortly. So hopefully this has been able to help someone out. I'm going to drop a link below so you can go ahead and start ordering this stuff, um, get it in and, and have it ready so that when you get this phone day one, you got a case on hand. Until next time, be sure and give me that big thumbs up and please subscribe. Average Tech Guy out. Peace.